Hello again, this is Priscilla Batzel. I'm in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Fluid Art Studio. I'm going to share with you my 12 by 24 inch canvases that are recent and probably from last year. And the usual price for 12 by 24 is 640, 650 bucks, basically. So the half price is 325. I've got my cell phone light on so you can see the shimmer. And I'm just going to keep moving forward. I found a couple escapes. And the first one is on sale and the second one is not. Oh, I forgot to tell you the number. <laughs> That's 8724. That's a shovel pour. Then we have 8793, which is a big, a big abstract wave with a couple of cat hairs that don't belong. Then I have 9345, which just today I retrieved from a show at the Brooksville Uptown Gallery. And this is not on sale. This is full price. Then we have... Everything's going to be shown in a horizontal aspect because <laughs> otherwise we won't get through this. So this is 9346. Again, 9346. I'm going to try and put them aside one at a time. Then we have 8876. Very shimmery, very, very beautiful in person. Let's bring down 8867. This is, I tried to stack them in a series. So let's see how that works. And again, 8867 is absolutely gorgeous. That's one of my favorites. Then we have 8744. Oh, I thought there were more in that series, but I guess it's done. This is a gorgeous abstract expressionist piece. I love this piece. The textures, the scratch, scratching, the little checks, everything. Just I just love it. Then we have 8669. And this is gorgeous colors. Reminds me of the inside of a of some sort of muscle shell. Even prettier than that, maybe. Then we have 8728, which has got lots of fall colors, very coppery, very shimmery. Then we have 9411. This is recent. Lots of great texture in there. I love how the cells are. The background is one texture and the, and the cells are all totally glossy. And I have gallery wrapped 9412. This is also not on sale. But I will let it go for the regular price instead of the gallery wrapped price. Which again is 650. This is a beautiful piece of artwork. Then we have 9344, and I'm going to have to get rid of some of these right now. If they'll go, my box is too small. I say again, 9344. Then we have 9251. These I know I can put in that box. This is, I love, I love the subtleness of this. It's also very dynamic as well. 9251. Then we have one that I didn't put a number on. Yeah, there it is. I found it. 9093. It's on the crossbar. And this has got a gold background. This is gorgeous cells. Then we have 9387, which is somewhere across, across modern technology and uh, maybe possibly even Native American style. Then we have, what did I say? I said it was 9387. 9273, 
similar to one we just saw, but I think I like it better, this one. And it's got a lot of shimmer. Beautiful. 9273. 9291 is next. And that's this is just glassy and glossy and lots of fun. And we have 9293. More in the series. Of geometrics. I call these geometrics because there's basically a lot of square, a lot of angles. 9430. Wait a minute. So I said that again was 9293 right there. Then we're moving on to 9403, which is really cool. I love this. This is almost brand new. Very, very recent. Great texture. Great patterns. Lots of fun to do, too. There's bound to be videos that go with 99% of, of the paintings that you're seeing now. Maybe, all of them may not have aired yet. 9252. I love the texture in this. I really, really do. I love this piece a lot. 9252. Then I have, what do I have? Something without a number on it? Oh, please don't. Okay, I found it. <laughs> 9096. Excuse my head. And this is, this is just simple and sublime. And paint chips will be gotten rid of. And we have 9082. I should repeat that again. That was 9096. Then we have 9082. A friend of mine mentioned to me that I ought to meant that I ought to say the numbers before and after, but I evidently I'm having a little bit of trouble with that. So this is 9082. And lots of fun. I love the glossiness. The Gersonia gloss varnish I use in my, in my Vivid Intense, um, excuse me, in my Vivid Polypore and Vivid Enamel makes that so glossy. 8886. This is relatively new. I love the textures in this. I know I say that a lot, but I also love the glossiness. I'm going to have to check and make sure that we're all still in square. We have 8846. Oh, that's another geometric. I adore this. If this never sells, that would be okay with me. If somebody is smart enough to buy it, that would be okay with them, I'm sure. Uh, 8846. Followed by 8795. And I need a second. No, I'll just stack them. I love this too. Cat hairs aside. This is fun. I like the patterns of that. I like the negative space too. 8795. Then we have, well it looks like a do-over, maybe. Yes it was. 8326. Oh yeah, this one goes with the other one. They're not really a pair, but they're from the same couple of days. I'm going to move some paintings around so I can get them down into position. Just a moment. Love, love, love. Wouldn't worry if this never sold. So we have 8889. This is one of the swipes that reminds people of people which I need to do more of. Like this is definitely a party piece. And again it's 8889 followed by 9315. That looks like it goes with that original set I was working with before. Which is in another location so I'll move it. This is relatively recent. 9315. 
Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Same thing. I wouldn't sell it if I didn't have to. I like this style. This is my abstract expressionist fun time. Give me a second. I'm trying to keep myself somewhat organized. I just love the colors in this. I love how the pink pops and the white makes it happen. 9208 followed by 9320, which is a similar style, I think, but definitely one of the only ones I have with the dots and the, uh, the swiped colors. 9320 to be followed by 9289, which is another a similar type of style because of the dots. This was a this was a double or a triple do-over. I love how that turned out. But I, I'm a big fan of my own artwork lately. 8880. We're not going to talk about this. This could be considered X-rated in my opinion. I'm not going to describe why I think so. But I do love the shimmer in the middle. And the textures are just great. So 8880 to be followed by 8879, which is a similar style. Very decadent. Look at all that shimmer gold. I'm sh pretty sure that that gold is more than likely golden maple. Then I have 8, excuse me, that was 8879. This is 8836, which is definitely garden theme. Lots of shimmer in there. Not as much as some, but uh, still plenty of it. What did I say? 8836 to be followed by 9259, which is pretty cool, actually. 9259. This was fun and funky and a little bit of problematic at the time, but I think it turned out pretty cool. I've got one that's upside down. We have 9236. Oh, that goes with that other series. Which I have just enough room to do something with. Then we're going to go and have a break and do some scoop, uh, swipe, scoop, spin, and drags. We have 9175. Which has some shimmer. And a little gloss and lots of great cells. 9175 and 9174 next. I love this piece. I really do. Give me a moment. This has got some really nice stained glass quality to it. And that Chantilly lace is awesome. 9174 to be followed with 9176. Look at those colors and look at those gorgeous cells. I think they call them peacock cells when they have a lot of color inside colors. 9176 to be followed by 9173. I'm going to move a few more things down. I hope that I can get them in position without a box falling over. Yes, I think we're going to succeed. Just one more second. Oh, I saved it. I'm going over. Yay. I guess we're just going to bring them all in here. Very shimmery gold in there. Again, 9173. 9074. 9074. Very ocean like. 9126. I'm sorry I don't remember to say the number before and after every time, but I'm giving it my best shot. Then we have 9119, 9119, <laughs> which is very decadent, dark and delicious. 
very deep shimmer in the gold, which is probably interference gold. We have 9054, which is love, lovely, luscious, and very purple. I like it a lot. Then we have, well, let's go back, back again, 9054, followed by 9071. Oh yeah, this is a favorite. This is stunning in person. Really colorful. Lots of awesome energy. 9071. You'd be lucky to have that. 9080. This one's more subtle than most. Sometimes I like to work with black and white, and this definitely had some interference gold in it. So it's a lot, um, I don't know, I just find it a little more calm, I guess. 9134. I remember this. I remember many of them, actually. Plenty of gold shimmer in there. It's a little crazy. No big deal. I don't think anyway. Part of the texture. 9134 to be followed by 8975, which is another autumn. Autumn flavored colors with the copper and the gold and the silver and the Chantilly lace. Look for the 20% off color art coupon code. If you like my colors, they're all from color art. Primary elements, prism pores, vivid, vivid intense. I didn't read it, did I? 8973, but I caught myself. So a lot of these, especially these, this is the top and that's the bottom because they should go like this, but we're never going to fit them in the, under the monitor if we do that, so hopefully that's easy enough to discern, but you could always have them any way you wanted them to. 9117 is another beautiful, colorful, energetic piece. Just reminds me of, oh, I don't know, spring breezes, basically. 9117 to be followed by 9161 which is definitely another one of my paintings that I would call decadent. Very rich in colors. And it's supposed to be, yep, that's supposed to be the top, but I think it goes equally well in the horizontal. So I have 9055, which is awesome. I love this. I've got Two minutes left and hopefully I don't need all of it but when the timer goes off I'll have one minute left so I'm gonna shimmer this and get on with it and I said that was 9055 maybe I've been taking too long this one is kind of strange this one is 9162B but it'll give me a moment to get the rest of these in front of you this one's just um, reminds me of cartoon colors then we have 9369, which obviously you can tell is this, supposed, this is supposed to be the top. Then we have 9350. I'm trying to speed up a little bit, which I totally love. The Chantilly lace in there is perfect. Then we have 9190, which is delicious. We're going to try and get it done. I love this so much. Then we have, what do we have? I can't tell. 918, no, excuse me, 9081. Another one that goes with that other one. And then I have my last two paintings. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up. 9215. Oh, this is a favorite. And 9. If I don't sell this, this would be okay with me. 9215, and very last, but not least, remove the paint chips. I didn't say the number. Okay, 9274, and I love you guys. And uh, I have two books because I can in Unlimited Possibilities. Don't forget the uh, Pixel Paint Designs coupon code for 10% off for Australian Floetrol and Boom Gel and Pebio Paints, or, or the uh, 